All right, today we are going to be working on my seat belt uh, where it retracts at right here. Goes all the way through into this. Just gonna open this up. Uh, I, I fixed it once with my friend Frank and it was working and then out of nowhere it just stopped working. So right now we're gonna open up this panel again and we're gonna get right back to it. I'll show you guys exactly how to do it. Uh, usually it's not really bad. What it is is that there's a lot of nasty like gunk that builds up in the inside of it. I just need to grab my tools in the back. Ugh. What do I need? Well, that's what I need right there. <sighs> Gotta hold my head up. Oh, I think I just need this little thing, but just in case, I grab my other tool, which is just like sockets and shit, which I don't think I really need, but fuck it. Ugh. I need to get that fixed. I don't have my, uh, the little, whatever you want to call them, that hold up the, the back <sighs> hatch. <sighs> no, nah, it's fine. All right, I had to use a flashlight because there's no light in here. So um, first, what we're going to have to do is get like a little flathead or something. And we need to open up this little piece right here and this one right here. There's screws right here. You got to take these out and then you could just pull them off because there's clips in here. I think there's like one here somewhere in here. Uh, you got to pull these off. This is underneath here. So you have to pull this one as well to get this one out. Okay, we're going to get started on that right now. All right, we got this one out. Now we just need to get this one out. And hopefully I can get it out because I'm trying to do this without stripping it. And I'm just trying to think, am I, is that tightening it? Nope, I was going the wrong way, sorry. It always gets a little confusing when you got, a, you got the bolt upwards instead of the other way. All right, now we got the bolt out. Uh, usually I would say keep everything like somewhere where you know where it's at. For me, I'm just going to put them right here because I'm not going anywhere crazy. Actually, you know what? Let's do this. Just so we know nothing gets lost, we will put them inside of my beanie. Beanie for the trust win, yeah? Alright, let's hope that you guys can see from right here. You gotta kind of like fidget with it a lot. Um, it is a bit difficult. It's not something too crazy, but right here there's a clip that you have to pull down. And then you have to kind of like. Oops, well, I think I broke a clip. All right, so I was taking this off and it Sound like something broke and fell down, but one of these little tab pieces slipped out from here. But that's all right. I don't think I'm gonna need it right now at this moment. So put this over here. I think this side is like a, I wanna say like a 14. Open up this, don't make fun of me. This is a mess. Ooh, just barely off, it's all right. I don't think it's this, it's this for sure. What in the heck was that? All right, there we go. This size is a 14. There you go. And this fits right on. No, I just got the just a little ratchet. inside the trusty beanie bag. Three bolts right here, boom, boom, boom. This little piece off right here. Okay, make sure that doesn't go anywhere. You wanna take this piece off first. And the inside here, like with something, uh, it looks like silverish. There was a bunch of just nasty gunk all up inside of here, like completely covered. It looked like uh, lead from a pencil. All right, 
So to get this out, you gotta kinda lift this piece up and you gotta just kinda mess with it just a bit to get this out. It does require a little bit of muscling. I just drop it on a little clip. Good. Okay, so usually this is where it makes contact at. I pulled the line or the plastic track piece that connects to this. You just pull it and it comes all the way off. And then you can see exactly how nasty it is and how gunked up it is right here. See that? You don't want any of that stuff that's all up in there. You want to get rid of this. Alright, so I cleaned it about as much as I could. It's definitely better than what it was. There was just a bunch in there. Probably get that little piece out and then put it back in. There's a part I forgot to say, which was right here. Well, there's three tabs that you have to push down to get the piece out. And then you have that little plastic piece. So, and then when you pull that other piece, there's like little uh, prongs on stuff like that. You have to clean that all out. It's where the little piece that you push down on the top. Inside of this, which looks just like the one that sits on this. So you'll see this, and this might have some stuff on it. You want to clean that. And then you'll see this, and if stuff is inside here, clean this. You will find a spring in there, and this is what sticks out of the top of the other piece that I just had in my hand. You will push it from this side out, and it'll come out. Be careful, though, when you unhook this, because there's a plastic piece. This tiny little plastic piece that sits down there, it will fall out. Like it did for me, I had to find it. So, you want to clean all this up. You want to clean that piece, you want to clean this piece, and you want to clean that. And then from there, we will see if that's what was causing the issue. Okay, I put everything back, and right now we're going to have the moment of truth if this is working right now. So, let's turn her on. Okay, shut the door. There we go, baby. We got it working. Let's go. Really, all you had to do is just clean everything out. Uh, usually, that stuff should still be working. There we go. Yes. Let's go, baby. Let's go. All right. That will be the end of it for today's video. I thank you guys for watching. Uh, please like, subscribe, and leave a comment and what you guys think I need to do better. Um, I was really hard to film everything right now just because of myself being in here and no one else there to film me, which is fine. We're just getting started. I will get a tripod or something soon so I can actually just set it up anywhere in the car or whatever I'm doing, just if, if no one's there to help me film. So that was today's video. Thank you. Love you guys. Peace.